Hi again. I haven't really been keeping up that well lately. I feel kind of bad for that. I've just gotten kind of busy. Um, I'm going to talk about this, I guess, past week or so. There's a lot that I forgot already though, <laughs> so it won't be as detailed as it could have been if I were to do it on time and post it to my blog. It was it Friday, I had gone to, where did I go? The Big Buddha. That was awesome. Loved it so much. Saturday, I don't remember what I did. <laughs> Sunday, I did something. Oh, I went shopping in um, this area called Mongkok. And basically, it's a huge, there's lots of markets in that area. One of the markets, one of the famous markets is called Ladies Market. And I went there with some friends and we ate. Uh, we ate there and we did lots of shopping. I mostly just kind of wanted to price things out and like figure out how people bargain and such because I was going to have to do that later on. I had to go and do a project at school, so I had to cut my shopping time short. <laughs> so sad. Uh, did that, came home, and that was my, my Sunday. And Monday, I went back to Mong Kok uh, with my mom and did a lot more shopping, bought some things, bought some uh, souvenirs for those of you back in the States, yeah. Um, I'm definitely bringing some awesome things back. It's gonna be great. Cute little things, some other big things, nice stuff. Yeah, so do that. And then we went to this area, um, and like the tip of the tip of Hong Kong before you go to the island, and it's called uh, Chim Sha Shui, Shui, whatever. I can't say it right. Chim Sha Shui, yeah. Say it really fast and then it works. Um, so my mom and I went there. We went to go look around a little bit. Went to this park and ate some dim sum. It was great. Um, yeah, so I want to take her. I want to take my mom there mostly because she hadn't been there yet. Neither, me, neither, neither of us have been there yet. Um, and I wanted her to see just like something new right before she left. So that was really nice. It was great. And. Um, when I came back, went to class because I had an evening class that day. And um, afterwards, some of my friends wanted to get together and like say bye to my mom and stuff. So we all went down to the Italian restaurant that's close to my apartment. It's called uh, Restos. And um, we had dinner there. Oh my god, like we weren't really that hungry, but we ate so much food. We had we had ribs. We had like a seafood plate. Uh, or like dish whatever basket and we had um, we had pasta and we also had I think we had one more thing uh, buffalo wings chicken wings whatever no buffalo wings yeah so that was all so good and then we all had smoothies which was also so good and then we had dessert. Oh my gosh. Dessert was so good. Well, we got two desserts. One of them was like this brownie sundae thing. Um, and it had this delicious brownie. It was so good. We had that. And then we had um it was it was an ice cream and it had some strawberries on it and it looked so pretty and nicely well put together. And then there was like this Mars bars cheesecake, which was really, really, really good. I've never had a cheesecake like that before and it was awesome. And so we did that, that was really awesome. I said everyone said bye to my mom and stuff. And then Tuesday, my mom left in the morning and uh, then I went to class, got back early. Well, not really early and then I think I was hanging out with my roommate one of my roommates and we we're just caught talking and stuff and that was really nice I enjoyed that a lot and then Wednesday was a holiday which I have to make up for next Friday not cool uh, but um 
we had a holiday and I did uh, actually I procrastinated on the homework to be honest but I still got it done though um that eve that like afternoon-ish I went with one of my friends and we went to the Hong Kong Art Center on Hong Kong Island and we watched this um like indie film for the Hong Kong International Film Festival and it was this really awesome documentary. Like it was really funny, and it was it was basically uh, about this about like Filipino life. Like there were it was a Filipino made movie. It was really cool, and it reminded me of all my Filipino friends and family back at home. Oh, it was great. You guys would love it if you saw it. You really would. Um, uh, what else? And then after that. My friend and I went to go get some bubble tea, and then we walked all the way up to this beautiful park. But it wasn't as beautiful because it was nighttime, so we couldn't see everything. But it was still really pretty, pretty, pretty. Blah, blah, blah. It was really, really pretty. Um. And so we did that, talked and stuff, and then the area where the um the film was played was in this area called Wan Chai and in the Wan Chai district is basically where all like the bars are and stuff and where strippers and prostitutes are apparently kind of creepy my friend and I passed by these like bars and then also these places like like strip clubs I guess and and there were like Filipino girls in front of there or it was mostly Filipino girls there. It was lots of Filipinos in that area. Um and they were like dressed like really skanky and like scandalous and stuff, like with this like um with their like little skirts like literally like an inch below their butt, not even an inch, like it was like right on the line. And it was just kind of gross looking, to be honest, to me at least. It wasn't that appealing at all. And then, so, yeah, that was that. That was a very interesting experience, I will say. And then my friend and I, we hit up a bar uh, because it was ladies' night, so we got free drinks. Free is always good. Don't spend the money. Um, yeah, and that was great, and I had my first legal drink, yeah, it was alright, <laughs> um, and we hung out there, and we were talking, and, like, when we got there, it wasn't really too, too crowded, because, like, 10 p.m., and it starts getting crowded later than that, obviously, so, um, we were talking and stuff, and we were getting, like, really, really into our conversation and all, we are like, yeah, blah, 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 like, blah, 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 oh my god, like, this, this, and this, like, oh, that reminds me of this story, blah, 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 and then we are getting ready to leave, and then we looked around, and it was, like, like, packed, and then, so, anyways, like, we left, and so after that, <clears throat> we went back to mainland, and we went to Temple Street, um, in the night, the night market there, and by the time we got there, though, a lot of places were closing down for the night, but we walked around, like, the street and the other open places, and that was really cool, and, um, then afterwards, we took the MTR back to Sam Po, which is where the school is, and then from there, we would take the bus back home to Gold Coast, because you can only take the bus to Gold Coast, but anyway, so we got back to Sam Po, and... Um, it was so, 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 so empty. So empty. It's kind of weird how empty it was. Yeah. It was really empty. It was kind of creepy. But anyway, so we waited for the bus, got the bus, took the bus home, and yeah, that was that. And then, <laughs> um, let's see, Thursday, since I was out so late on... Wednesday, um, I ended up missing one of my classes, and then I went to my other class, and then <sighs> I missed the bus, like the SCAD bus to go to class, because I lost my ID somewhere in my room, and so I had to take, I had to take the public bus to class, and I was like, ah, oh, so I ended up getting to class like an hour late, which is so unfortunate, but 
I didn't miss that much. That was okay, which is really, really good. Um, and I came home and, oh, well, I stayed, after class I stayed and I was working in the lab for a couple of hours. And then I came home, got ready in like 30 minutes. There was this event for one of the um, SCAD clubs that they have for like the like music club, I think, multi-music club. So that was out in uh, Sumtaswe at one of the clubs. So we went there. We were like gonna like be there for a while or whatever. And then like after, like there was a model show going on and like after the model show, we were gonna learn how to DJ and stuff. And I was so excited for that. That sounded really cool. But then things didn't end up going that well. Like, like organization wise, it was but kind of poor. And we ended up not learning that stuff, but we still got to talk to like the DJs and they were really awesome. I love talking to them. They were great people. Um, and then after that, we went out, we had a lot of fun that night, and um, it was really great. I enjoyed myself a lot, um, relaxed, which was really nice, met, some, met a lot of really cool people, and um, came home, and by that time, it was really, really late at night. I was so tired. Um, so today, Friday... I slept in for like the first time past 9 a.m. <laughs> and I woke up at 2 in the afternoon and then just kind of hung out and stuff and then um, went and grabbed a, a late lunch, early dinner with one of my friends again. And we went out to the beachfront, walked along the beach and we're talking for a while and just walking around outside. And today was kind of not that great of a day, it was overcast, but... Um, like temperature wise it was it was suitable. I'm excited. Gonna plan something to do like tomorrow or Sunday, so we're taking lots of pictures. I haven't been taking that many pictures lately just because I have my huge camera, you know. Yeah, so I don't wanna be taking it around everywhere with me. Well I do take it around everywhere with me, but when I'm going out at night and stuff, I don't wanna have my backpack all huge and bulky, so other friends have been taking pictures, <gasps> so I need to get those pictures from them soon. But uh, yeah, that's been what's going on lately, and I will update you guys later on. It's been great. I love it so much here. Great experiences so far. I can't wait for the rest of this quarter. Um, but yeah. I'll be posting pictures, uh, who knows when, sometime soon, hopefully. Keep on the lookout for that, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!